My name is Hans Rey. I'm a professional mountain biker. I've been doing this game for the last 25 years and um, I'm a former trials biking world champion and the mountain bike hall of famer. And in recent years I've been really focusing on these adventure trips where I try to ride trails and terrain um, that haven't been ridden before and were considered unrideable. That's the Hans way during the daytime and, and in the off hours I'm, gonna ru I'm running a small charity together with my wife called Wheels for Life. Wheels for Life is a non-profit charity that gives bicycles to people in really great need in third world countries. The heart of the charity is to provide bicycles to people who need them and that's as simple as it gets. So bicycles have a very different meaning in the third world. The key, in my opinion, to, for people to break out of this vicious cycle of poverty is really the mobility. Bicycles uh, for us, I mean, I can't say that they're always a toy because a lot of people do use them to commute to work or to school, which is great. Obviously, it's environmentally wonderful. It keeps you fit. At the end of the day, though, it is still kind of a, a luxury that we here can afford quite easily. But in developing countries, a bicycle makes a huge difference. It means a child can get to school, which can be 10, 12 kilometers away, and he can get to school in, in half an hour rather than two hours. Hours. It gives you the opportunity to become self-sufficient and to maybe become an entrepreneur like a businessman. And then you have people like healthcare workers. I mean, the, the nurses out in these remote communities have to walk for, for miles. One of the most exciting things that, that I experienced uh, as a supporter for Wheels for Life was when Hans presented to me a photograph of a nurse in Africa holding a sign that said, thank you, Dr. Kramer. So it, it's a very real and tangible benefit uh, that Wheels for Life was able to give to her uh, using uh, the contribution that my wife and I uh, gave to Wheels for Life. Wheels for Life is a, a small charity, it's basically just Hans and myself and we have a board of directors and so we are small but we're also very pure and we can make sure that pretty much all of the donations go to bicycles. One of the really nice things for us is that we have all, all kinds of supporters, donators, um, some of them are industry people, um, companies that, that Hans works with, some of his sponsors have been extremely generous but also we have lots of smaller individual donators as I call them. Through my in context to the bike industry, a lot of uh, bike companies, including some of my sponsors, have supported us with various uh, really cool promotions or fundraisers. Like for example, Crank Brothers, they've been really supportive and they, the first thing, one of the first things ever, they made this special pedal. It explains here the charity's mission and they basically donated all the profits of these pedals to the charity. We, we, we got a check for $10,000, that was huge, that was one of the first years. And some, an example of a, a smaller donation would be, um, we had, for example, a, a girl who decided she didn't want birthday presents last year. She wanted donations for Wheels for Life instead. The letter said, Dear Wheels for Life, these are the donations that I got for my birthday. Each of my friends donated a little money instead of presents. I hope you can use it. That's one of the beautiful things about Wheels for Life and which personally makes me really happy that you can make an impact on people and, and especially kids and show them, look, it doesn't take only Bill Gates in this world to make a difference. You can do too. And, and I hope this is an inspiration just for many of the things this particular girl will, will do in her life. And because she knows she can make a difference. We want to, part of our little side mission here is to just make people feel good and have trust in charities. The bottom line is that most charities out there do a good thing and it only takes a little research for people to do, to find out how a charity works and to, you know, choose the ones they want to support, you know. Mm -hmm.